<laughs> Very special evening lined up for y'all, courtesy of our QB, Derek Carr. It was really full circle for me to be able to come back to the barbershop, have some, some of y'all come in here and see. Like, man, I'm just a kid. I was very recently just in your shoes, just that age and wanting to think about, man, what, what could I do with my life? We're here at Sculptures. You know, Seth was one of the first people I met uh, when I moved to New Orleans. He's an amazing man. What's something that we can collab on, do together, support the community, support him, uh, and this is, this is what we came up with. Derek's uh, hosting an event to hook up these uh, young gentlemen with, with fresh cuts. I'm so honored that he even picked me and my staff to, to, to host this event for him, you know? It's pretty awesome, to tell you the truth. One of my favorite memories growing up was I remember going to the Bar Nation's Barbershop in Fresno, California. And I'm out there and Lorenzo Neal walked in. And when I saw Lorenzo Neal, uh, it, it made all of my dreams all of a sudden look like a possibility, you know, because, <laughs> because I finally saw, you know, someone doing what I uh, wanted to do. And so if this sparks whatever dream is in some kid's heart to show them that it's possible, uh, then, then it's 100% worth it. Some of these guys got goals to, you know, to make it to the league and to really just, you know, to meet them and to see that they're regular guys and that they're just genuine. It means a lot, you know, and it really gives them a bigger picture and, a, you know, a different perspective. You know, by all of our teammates coming in here, it's been overwhelming to me just seeing how many teammates came to show these kids like, hey man, I was a kid just like you with a dream and it's possible, you just gotta outwork everybody. You know, I had a couple of them, a couple of kids huddled around me asking, you know, what's it take? And I said, you gotta make decisions that not everybody else is gonna make. And you know, just to encourage them on what it looks like to outwork everybody and what it looks like to accomplish your dreams. Be a part of that, I can't get in trouble, you know what I mean? He's basically saying, uh, you gotta make some tough decisions and you can't, you can't really go with your friends. Like, if your friend gotta do something, you can't do it because it's still like you gotta, you gotta wake up early in the morning and get to work and stuff like that. And like, I won't be like, I won't be like him, but I won't be like a Robbie Seaver. Like, I won't make it to the NFL, bro.